me now. It's a match day fun to experience. Hello everybody, Robin United Footy here and today it is time for another match day experience here on Robin United Footy channel. Last week we took on Blackburn Rovers at the New York Stadium and we won 4-0 against Blackburn Rovers last week. I couldn't believe that last week. And now we'll move on to this week. This week we travel to Watford versus Robin United at Vicarage Road Stadium today. This will be my this will be my second visit to the Vicarage Road Stadium. Uh, last time I went there, it was 2015. Did it really video then? But here I am now videoing it. So yeah, so my score prediction today. I am thinking we will win today. I think it'll be a narrow two-one win today. I think. Uh, Dan Balasa. And Shane Vernison, I think, today. So today, we're going on a train for a change today. So, yes. Yeah, so, anyway, then, guys, enjoy the video, and I will see you all in a bit. service from Sheffield through to London St Pancras calling at Chesterfield, Derby, Leicester and London St Pancras. We are expected to arrive there at approximately 11.39. Here we go. Off we go.
So now I am at Houston Station. Service to crew. Call it Milton Keynes. Rugby, Nuneaton, Ackleston, Tamworth, Litchfield, Trent I have a little lack of school next door to it. One of these. Tell us your name and stop finishing. My name's Hartley and I'm saying 
2 1 run for him up the Millers. Luca, uh, 3 0 Millers. Owen, I reckon it's to me. 2 1 run for him, last minute winner. Scenes, pitch invasion, it's going to be carnage. Meet me up as well. My name is Bailey and we're going to lose 4 0. <laughs> oh, I hope not. Thank you, Gary's. Of the fucking Millers. <laughs> Today's Skybet EFL Championship fixture with the Golden Boys taking on Rotherham United. Also, I must say a very warm welcome to today's match sponsor, Key Terrain Group. We hope you have an enjoyable afternoon with us here well, at the event. Lots to do yeah. now at kick off time. If you're looking for a good week on your Saturday six, make sure you pick up a copy of today's match day program. The Hornet, price of £3.50 for the sellers around the ground. You can read the thoughts of uh, Slava Bilic, our head coach, on pages six to seven as he reflects on that great game here at the league last week. Nice word it. And we've got an interview with the star of the match, Toby Adeyemo, on pages 12 to 13. Our player Q&A today is Leandro Bakuna, and our junior Hornets pull out as always at the centre pages. You can get yourself a poster of Craig Cathcart. So that's the Hornet match day program, three pounds fifty from the sellers around the ground. Right, if you want to look, look up at the big screen, we'll take you through the first reading of today's team news and we'll start with news of our visitors at Rotherham United. In goal number one, Victor Johansson. Four, Captain Daniel Barlazer. Seven, Terry Fossu. Eleven, Chinozi Ogbeno. Seventeen, Shane Ferguson. Eighteen, Oliver Rathbone. Twenty-one, Lee Caltier. 22, Hanky Madofu. 23, Sean Morrison. 24, Cameron Humphreys. And 29, Leo Hielba. Substitutes for Rotherham United. 26, Robbie Henfrey. 2, Wes Hardy. 3, Cohen Brown. 6, Richard Wood. 16, Jamie Lindsay. 20, Grant Hall. And 30, Peter Chioso. Now let's take a look at your Golden Boys side for today. In goal, it's number one, Daniel Backman. Three, Mario Gaspar. Four, Hamza Chowdhury. Eleven, Ishmael Kone. Thirteen, Joao Ferreira. Fifteen, and captain, Craig Cathcart. Nineteen, Vakun Bayo. Twenty-three, Ishmael Assar. 31, Francisco Serralta. 37, Mateus Martins. And 42, James Morris. Substitutes for the Golden Boys. 35, Maduka Okoye. 5, William Trustikon. 14, Hassan Kamara. 18, Yasser Estria. 25, Leandro Bakuna. 49, Michael Adunfoku. And 54, Toby Adeyemo.
Norwich in it. Last time we went in Norwich it was 20 quid for us. Leeds were there a week after it was 45. Yeah. It's as bad as our place, it's an atmosphere, isn't it?
put it inside and put it in. You can hold this out till after. We slid in this top corner this year. I did Blackburn. They expected to walk these days. <laughs> Oh, I'm fine. 
Scorer for the Hornets is number 13, Joao.
Ramo coming on. Substitution for Rotherham United. Coming off number 17, Shane Ferguson. He's replaced by number 54, Toby Adeyemo. Matthias Martins. And replacing him to make his league debut, it's number 49, Michael Adupoku.
The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of four minutes of time to get it on. That's four minutes of additional time. This was a new one this time, new train. Both of them are new trains. So ten is. It's many going on this way. What? Going away now. Oh wow, well, 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 well,
they tell you they bring them sandwiches, and drinks and stuff. Oh, I did, I did say I they were the shot shot shot. Yeah. In old days, when I used to watch Sheffield. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I don't know. Like what? Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Do you know yeah, yes. That's called cakes, isn't it? I don't know what it is. It's a big guy. 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 It's a Hello guys, it's time to end this match the experience from yesterday. Well, I could not believe it yesterday. We managed to draw one all at Watford yesterday. Our scores were by Shane Vernison yesterday. I can't remember who for Watford. So yesterday I went on the train to Watford from Sheffield to London. If you remember earlier in the video, I went from Rotherham to Sheffield first. Then we went from Sheffield to London to Pancras. And then we got the underground to Euston Station and did a bit of local video around and then I caught the London Overground to Watford High Street via the world. No, not via the world, but a couple of stops. So yeah, so we got to Watford High Street just after half past one. We had a nice steady walk down to the ground and on my way down I got myself a program I'm gonna show you now. So this is the program from Watford yesterday. So here's the front and the back but if you open the page that's where it shows you the team inside. So yes, um, so we're going ground out just before 2pm, we'll watch both teams warming up, listen to team use announcements and all that, bit, bit of music. What do I think for the ground? I thought it was the best ground I've been to. At least I've been, uh, last time I went to Watford, that corner stand wasn't built then, where that century room corner was. And half of that new stand were built then. So yes, um both team come out and what do I think to the game? I thought, first half, we were brilliant. We scored by Shane Vernison, first half. Read a quite a lot of added time with injury times. We got to one now at half time, so we were good. I thought we'll win this today. And then second half, it got a bit stronger from Watford. They scored like 60 or something minute. I can't remember it well. I think it was towards 50 or 60, 60 minute. I mean. So, yes. Um, Watford had a fantastic save from Victor O'Hanson towards the 80th minute sometime yesterday. Great save from him. Man, I match for me yesterday with Victor O'Hanson. He's doing great recently. I'm pleased with him. So, yes. So, after the match, we clapped him off as we was very happy with the point yesterday. So after the match, we went back to the train station. We caught the train back to London. And then got back to King's Cross. And then we caught the train home. Next up for Rotherham United. Sheffield United comes to the New York Stadium on Saturday the 4th of February. In two weeks yesterday. So next week we haven't got a game. 
due to Sunderland are in FA Cup fourth round, but we have a rearranged date for 21st of February. If case you didn't know that Swansea away has now been moved to a Monday night. So guess what? I won't be going to Swansea now. Thanks, Sky. So don't worry about it. I can't help it for this one. So I'm having a break anyway. So I'm not bothered about Swansea away now on a Monday night. Like everybody won't be going now either. So yes, uh, right then guys. Um... Please, Please like, like and, and subscribe to Rotherham United Footy. Right then guys, uh, thank you very much for watching. And I will see you all for Sheffield United at the New York Stadium on Saturday the 4th of February. So thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you next time on Running United Footy Channel. Peace out.